ladies and gentlemen, it's time for the team rounds. Two heroes, side by side, fighting together for their very survival. I love it how we're just Sauron. To the hero lineup. It's the sister of arena legend, Thunder. Let's hear it for Whisper. So, the two of them together, can they defeat the Balverines? Okay, fine. I'll make a weapon that actually can fight Balverines instead of just kind of inconveniencing myself. Because I don't think I got anything with silver. Uh, I guess full mall ninja. Sharpening. Lightning. Silver. Two. One. Go. Okay. You know, the sad thing is... Let's produce. Oh, that's why. Oh, is that it? All right, whatever. Two. One. Go. I got this. Let's get my meter up. If I can. There we go. You know, I was really expecting the silver augment to make me do more damage, but I guess the I've almost killed this one. That's not the point. Take that. Three, two, one, go. There we go. Hey, there's a white belvery, and I just killed one of you. Whoops, that ain't working. Let's say, why not put it on the hammer? Because uh, the hammer is actually pre-enchanted, so I can't change anything. Even if I wanted to. Not that it really changes too much. Like, it's a great hammer. It does a decent chunk of damage. I will never be out of time hacks. You may think yourself superior. Oh, I, you may think I will return to the yeah. land of normal time. This is lies. It's fed to you by other people. Three, two, one. I am just here to just. Go. Um, you know, I just realized because I'm in slow time here. Everybody must see me just shoveling massive quantities of meat into my face at, like, incredibly high speeds. At, like, actually upsetting speeds in human meat vacuum. <laughs> I am no chicken chaser. That is my true title. Ow. I deserved that. I walked right into that one. Oh. Now back to being the inhuman meat vacuum. A nice round thousand gold reward! Wow! Sixteen hundred in the bag! And there's another two thousand on offer for the next round! Has he got any elixirs to drift for EXP? Nah. I don't think so. And it's okay, I can get a higher multiplier later. Ladies and gentlemen, give them a big hand! The 
next round is a real favorite this year. Anyone who's braved Litchfield Graveyard recently will know what I'm talking about. It's the undead! Three, two, one, go! It's the undead. Uh, I should probably go back to my hammer. And they don't go down easy, but that means more That's multiplier for me? Hopefully more multiplier for me. Takes a while to bur build it back up, though. Okay. I almost kind of wish you could see some of this in, like, like a replay function, just to see what the arena looks like. I almost killed this one. In uh, like for everybody else, because you've got to imagine like being in the audience and beholding this situation. I, I'm just this guy that shows up and just starts speed beating every single thing that even tries Three, to set foot in the arena. Two, one, go. Oh, that's that's the button. I forgot the exact button to do anything. Okay, back to this. Looked like a DBZ fight. Yeah, that's probably not a bad summation. Which, specifically... She actually managed to get a kill from me. I did kind of leave it for her. How much meat do I have? Gosh. I've apparently been just hoarding meat like a crazy pe person this entire time. Oh, yes. Okay. Not enough meat. Fact. These are true facts. Definitely should invest invest in some magic. I almost killed this one. When I get the chance. Uh let's see you. Cause yeah, if I hit him on the back, it won't be so bad. That's it. What the Okay, I can't lock on to anything for some reason. That's really strange. Like how the voices are in slow-mo. It's just one very high-pitched, fast yelling dude that is just excited to be here. I hope that was worth 2,000 gold. I reckon it was. They've earned 3,600 gold. But will they stay for another round to net them another 3,000? I don't care. I'm just here to keep my multiplier so I can continuously eat meat. We've already lost three heroes. Well, it's time to make our surviving combatants even more nervous. It's round five, and here they are, spared from the headsman's block. Let's have a big hand for the bandits of the Black Hand Gang. Three, two, one. My arms really are not meant to extend above my head. Boop. Oh. 
Okay. Wow. These guys pull out their uh, swords in a hurry. How much meat do I even have left? Holy shit. I'll have to do some kind of turbo training to get my, like, archery skills up to par. Magic is kind of working itself, but, like, not to the extent that uh, my physical stats are. And if I could, like, true rapid fire in the same ma same way that... Uh, let's see. Oh. Go. Let's see. Items. Produce. Uh, let's see. We want carrot assigned to left. Fish assigned to right. Okay, fish is magic. It's not tofu. It actually makes my life a lot easier. Come on. Okay, there we go. This game really kind of needed a heavy attack. I know that's what the uh, the charge up kind of is. But that, what did even, oh, he did hit me. Three, two, oh, that's fine. One, we'll just start devouring fish. Go. Okay, we are properly devouring fish here. Okay, there we go. I'll just beat him from behind. Makes easier. Oh, yes. Unfortunately, the enemies get a lot blockier later on. Which I think was one, one of my enduring complaints about the Fable series. Uh, Fable series? First Fable game. I truly actually have no idea how combat even works in the other ones. Okay. Well, I'm gonna come out of here with an insane amount of EXP, which is exactly what I needed. They banked six thousand six hundred gold, and if that wasn't enough, another four thousand is available for the next round. That's it. All right. Next round. Our intrepid heroes have made light work of wasps, bandits, hobs, balverines, and even undead. What's next? What could possibly pose a threat to our noble combatants? Ladies and gentlemen, it's round six. The mighty Earth Trolls, Ingrid and Bertha. Three, two, one, go! Yeah, so it's way better in Fables 2 and 3. Yeah, I, I think I will go with that idea. Uh, I originally had... I, I think I straight up will actually uh, I think I will straight up actually do a franchise run on Fable. I've never played 2 and I've only pay, played a very very small smidge of 3 so I would not mind actually playing through like all of them. Hopefully people remain interested the entire way through, but, yeah, I mean, I am. I really wish I could get faster than this in this game, considering how much fish I'm devouring. Wow, a total of 10,600 gold! Enough for a small house! Do they want another 8,000 gold? So you and Shell can get married in three of, again if she decides to play. I'd have to get around games for Windows Live, though. But 
one stand between our noble heroes and their winning. Is that a pile of rubble? No, it's the Rock Trolls, Stanoff and Groin. Three, two, one, go! I. How much HP do you have? Tons. Ow. That's not cool. Ow. I wonder if I should hide on the other side of this guy. My gosh! This is just infuriating. At least if there's only one left, it won't be so bad. How much magic EXP is this going to give me? That's... Ooh. There we go. Because I've considered this strategy for getting as much magic EXP as possible is to hang out and just Palpatine something to death. Well, jamming fish into my face. It's not... It doesn't seem like it's worth it. Yeah, just jam fish in face. Go from there. Yeah, fi fish is straight up better. There we go. Have fun with that whisper. Oh, wow! Another 8,000 gold! 18,600 in the bag, and only one round to go. Is it worth dying for another 10,000? gentlemen today you have seen the best of albion's arena fighters put your hands together for our successful heroes but now round eight the final battle i give you Arachanox. three two one go no Correct me if I'm wrong, but I'm pretty sure this thing is only fightable here. What? Why the hell would you give me a crunchy chick? Ah, oh, you shit. Whatever, it's fine. Alright. It's a really awkward fight. Oh. I didn't remember it summoned babies. Probably shouldn't actually be in in time mode. A I'm out of fish.
<laughs> but why would I why would I put my weapon away? Ah I don't like how spinny Arachnox is. Like it is it's this weird thing. Where it like it effectively oh It just kind of hitboxes you a bunch. Let's see, what does Tofu give? I don't remember. Ha. I've almost killed this one. Let's see, when it's doing the charge move, hit the eye. I mean, I could. That requires archery, yeah? It's like the one thing I'm not super specced into. Ah, Tofu is the anti-crunchy chick. Okay, pretty sure it's dead. Yep, pretty sure it's dead. Well, let's just jam carrots into my face. This is a good meal time. The Arena Bank is truly broken! That's another 10,000 gold! This is for a massive total of 28,600 gold! We have two winners! Incredible! So, what will happen? Two winners and only one prize? Well, as you know, we have a special guest here today. It's the one, the only, the hero of heroes, Jack of Blades! I have returned. After an eternity away from you all, Jack of Blades is back. This arena is all that is great in Albion, and you all that is worthy in it. I am honored to stand before you again. And I have a proposal to mark the occasion. One final round. A fight to the death between the two heroes still standing. The winner will receive a special prize. The loser will have the privilege of dying before you. What do they think they're doing? They can't do this. I'm going to put on a good fight, but I'm not killing you. I can't kill you. We came here to put on a good show, and that's what we're going to do. Let's go. Ah. Well, time to just speed smoke Whisper. I remember why what I hated about the Come Whisper on. character this is... in this game. I like the idea of Whisper, but the moment... The moment the arena happens, she turns into no one. And that's something I, that always bothers me in a lot of games, is that the moment a character can die is the moment they stop being a character in the game. All he has to do is give her one final strike, and the bonus prize is his! But will he do it? Will he kill Whisper? Or will he throw his victory away? Don't do it, farm boy. We agreed. Just walk out. We agreed. 
Let's stop fighting now. I haven't got much fight left. You win. Just head for the door. Fuck. <laughs> My dear lady, it was mere luck. He's nothing but a... Ah, there you are. The hero they're all talking about. I'm impressed. And that doesn't happen often. But I forgot my manners. I am Lady Grey. The Mayor of Bowerstone. I can see you are a man of worth. You should pay me a visit at my Bowerstone North Manor. My lady... If you would only li Thunder, I am tired of your protests, tired of your jealousy. The time of your glory is long gone. You should learn to accept that. As I was saying, Hero, I do hope you will accept my invitation. We have much to discuss. This is not over. New blood spills just like any other. And yours will spin soon. Yeah, you try that and I'll fart in your face. That was unbelievable. I haven't seen anything like it for a long time. I'll guide you back through the Hall of Heroes. You truly deserve to stand amongst them. I must say, you remind me of someone who fought here many years ago. Memory's not what it used to be, but I think her name was Scarlet Robe. That's right. Ever heard of her? Probably not. It was all before your time. But if you look on your right, you'll see her statue. She was the first female hero to become arena champion. Sup, dearest mother? <sighs> you can tell I've been putting on She's weight. She's a fine hero. Just as soft-hearted as you. But her dedication came with a price. After her final battle, she was never the same. She lives now in complete solitude, crushed by her failure to save her family long ago. And yet here you are. I knew her son would end up here one day. It's in your blood. And in your sister's too. You should bring her to me. I so long to reunite you both with your mother. Just think of the happiness it would bring her. This was the true face of his mother, Scarlet Robe, Slayer of Balverines. Once one of the fiercest heroes in all of Albion, yet her most splendid battle was also to be her last. Ambushed by a dozen Balverines, Scarlet killed them all, only to fall injured and drained beside their corpses. There she would have died, but for Brom, a kind and simple woodsman, who tended her back to health. In time, they married and had two children, a girl and then a boy. Scarlet's days of death were forever behind her. Whatever you decide, you've earned the champion seal. People everywhere will recognize you as the winner of the arena, and it will grant you access to Bowerston North. Don't lose it. It is rather valuable. I kind of wish I could press the emote buttons during cutscenes for my own extra flavor. The flavor is farts, but still. Hey, you. Theresa wants you to meet her at the Grey House. Astonishing. Oh, okay, Grey House? Oh, Grey House. Fair enough. Is that the, uh... 
So that's the one in the dark wood that was closed for renovations. That's the trick. Yes? Or is this a different one? I don't actually... No, I haven't been here before. So, you finally met Jack of Blades. I met him long ago, of course, when he burned down our home and cut out my eyes. But he wasn't lying when he said he knew where Mother was. He's kept her in Bargate Prison ever since the night of the raid. I haven't been able to get inside, but the archaeologist knows of an ancient secret passage. You've met him already, haven't you? Jack's creatures are still after him, just like they're after me. I can't stay here much longer. I've left the details in a quest card at the guild. You have to get Mother out. She's the only one who knows how to reach the sword. You did read the book I sent, didn't you? The sword is everything, and it could turn the world to nothing. Oh, and Mother has a gift for you too. More power than you can imagine. I forgot about this house. Is this Lady Grey's house or is this a different one? That was easy. And you have a ruby. I don't need no stinking rubies. Let's see, I don't remember if there's anything upstairs. Oh, there's one of the silver chests. I still don't know if I'm going to care to go for all the silver keys. I could. I finished before you in the human race. You what? Oh, right. This is like one of the few places to use the shuffle. Found a tattoo card. Was that it? Was that all that there was? That's 1 a.m. Going to bed. Yeah, have a good night. I should probably do the same. I've been over recording a lot lately, and so it'd be kind of nice to have an earlier <laughs> evening. Can I talk? What do you got? Single men, not a lot. Okay, so we have to. We have to get itched. I need the quest. Yeah, I thought so. Let's go to the Heroes Guild and see how much my relentless snacking has netted me. Because honestly, I need to, after all of that eating, I need to go eat some food myself. Uh, wow. Dang, that's not even close to enough. Uh, let's see. Got a lot of magic experience, too. Let's see, what do I want to invest into? Huh. Wait, hold up. Summon. Summon wrenches a creature's soul from the netherworld to help it 
Help the caster. If it kills another, it's replaced by the soul of a newly fallen victim. High levels allow you to keep it summoned for longer. Only the virtuous can master this spell. That doesn't sound virtuous! Like, that doesn't even sound re remotely close to virtuous. I'm just gonna max out magic power for the time being. Uh, let's see. I don't remember which of these are actually worthwhile. I know Divine Fury is pretty good. But expensive. I don't really care about the rest of these. Oh, can strike more than one foe at a time. Let's just go f full Palpatine for a little while. Oh, lightning's maxed out. Good to know. Okay, now lightning is maxed out. Okay, break the siege. Lost traitor. Rescue the archaeologist. Cool. Let's see if I remember any of these things when I play tomorrow. Assuming I play more of this tomorrow. We'll have to see what the schedule is going to be. For now, though, it's getting late. People are ducking out, and I need to go eat food because I haven't eaten in quite some time, and I am hungry.